and olive oil is a key component of that. Um, but you got to be careful. Uh, a recent uh, University of California Davis um, uh, study uh, analyzing a bunch of uh, supposedly extra virgin olive oils. You know, those are the expensive high-end uh, olive oils that are sold. Um, well, surprisingly, two out of three uh, bottles, six, some 60%, of the, uh, the the extra virgin olive oil that was analyzed was found to not uh, hold up. Uh, so that uh, is because they had it was altered. Uh, it was using um, perhaps some other oils that are cheaper or using non extra virgin olive oil. There's a number of tricks, uh, and we have to remember, uh, hey, human. Uh, in you know when there's a lot of money involved in selling anything, there's going to be unscrupulous folks and scammers out there that are going to take advantage. So here's what you need to do to be sure you've got the good stuff. Um, number one, do the sniff test. Just smell the olive oil. Be sure that it has a fruity smell, something like something like fresh olives. Okay. Uh, secondly, you can uh, go for the organic stuff. Look for a USDA organic seal. That's also very helpful. And my third tip for a good olive oil, top olive oil, is make sure it comes from only one country. Look, you have to read the label. You have to be a detective, um, but uh, one country only. Because if it's blended, uh, there's more chance for fraud. So that's all for now. Uh, Dan O'Byrne, MetabolicMotivation.com. Thanks.